Oh, Felipe, in the front right here. Uh, we see you with the boot on your foot. So I guess uh, what exactly happened in that fight that uh, caused this injury to your leg? Yeah, it was a lot of calf kicks. The calf kicks were so good. I think my opponent got a hurt too. And let's see what's gonna, what what a time it's gonna take to recover. But I think it's, it's a 20 days, 15 days, I will be ready to training again. Is it a broken foot or just uh, like injured or sore? Or what like a ligament? What exactly was the? Um, I'm not did a, I'm not doing uh, X-ray yet, but let's see what's gonna what's gonna see. And you obviously mentioned the calf kicks. Was that the game plan coming in to try to you know capitalize on that and slow him down? Can you repeat, please? Were the calf kicks the game plan coming into this fight? Yeah, the calf kicks is always my game plan because always working. If you have a good time to calf kick your opponent, it's working very good. So I'm going work at this fight again. And it's, I love calf kicks. <laughs> So he's, Iwan is known to pretend to be hurt against the cage, you know, it's because he wants you to rush in and attack and then he can counter. Uh, were you aware of that too? Because it looks like he was trying to do that to you, especially in the first round. Yes, uh, he pressured me a lot in the, in the first round. Uh, the game plans was to move me a lot, losing a lot of footwork. And I'm doing this. He catch me with some punch and catch him with some punch. And the wrestling working working very good at the the next round, the second and the third round. So, what did you make of his uh, his green uh, like makeup at the weigh-ins when you guys faced off? Yes, uh, I like his show. Sure. I like his show. Yeah, I'm kidding with him too in the in the weight teams. So this is good for the for the big show. The guy's doing things like that. <laughs> and then last one for me. Uh, once you get healed up, uh, when would you like to fight again? And at what point do you start uh, thinking of names that you would like to fight? I said to fight again in UFC Rio since 2011. I don't fight in my, in my country. I love to fight there. But let's see what's going to happen with my foot. And my next opponent, uh, I don't have a name right here, but I want to fight a one ranked guy. And, and let's see what's going to happen. Let's see what's going to happen. I, I will be ready for the big challenges. Looking right here. Obviously, uh, four straight wins now. Just curious, what do you uh, credit the recent success to? Yeah, four win streak. I'm very happy. First of all, my success come from God, my faith in God to give me the healthy, to train hard every day, to come here to to show my work, show my talent, the talent that he's given to me. My coach, Mike Rod, Ronnie Marquez, Catel Cub, my coach from American Top Team. The guys helped me in Brazil also for this, at this camp, the jo Kimura Jojão. Um, and yes, God, the talent he's gave to me, my coach, my team, all together, and the wins coming. And you're doing so well as a, a light heavyweight. Is there any chance you would ever go back to heavyweight or, or is that chapter of your career now closed? Light heavyweight right now is my home. Um, I'm feeling, feeling very great, very, very healthy. Um, I did a, a good job at heavyweight. We never know, but I want to stay in light heavyweight, but we never know if they're fighting in heavyweight again, if the greens was good. We can fight in there again. <laughs> Congrats. Thank you. Over here. Right here. I'm curious, were you surprised after all the kicks to his legs, he was still up and coming after you? Did that surprise you at all, his toughness like that? Yes, he is very tough. Kotalabe is a very, very tough opponent. I catch him with, with a very good calf kicks. Oh, my gosh. And he's, he's still coming. He's still coming, but yeah, he surprised me with this, bro. He surprised me. And then I also noticed later on in the fight, you went more to the grappling. Was that because of your foot or that's what you wanted to do? Because the kicks were working so well. It seemed like you kept him standing up. 
that the kicking was working for you, but then you took him down. Was that just because of your foot or just that was strategy? And that is a strategy. I'm a, a complete fighter. Uh, I'm throw punches. I'm, I'm love boxing. Um, I like wrestling. I'm a guy from coming from jiu-jitsu. So it's an MMA fighter. It's an MMA fight. And I um, always want to show my, my work at all martial arts. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Have a great night. I appreciate it.